which expression is equivalent to this? We're practicing our exponent rules. And so let's try playing around. We see our options here. I see these are generally reciprocals. So let's try to rewrite that as a reciprocal. So we have a negative exponent. So I'm going to go 1 over. This here is equals to 1 over. Uh, this here is uh, negative c squared. That's the part within the brackets. And this whole thing is going to be to the 1 third. Now we know that fractional exponents, uh, one third means it's the cube root. So I'm going to take the cube root of this whole thing. So this is going to be the cube root, which is index three of this whole things, which is a, a is correct. They're equivalent. Now in this little note here, it's saying that uh, another question would be to simplify it to make this answer look like this. So how would we do that? Let's try looking at this one here. We have some inside part within the brackets. This is equivalent to negative, negative 1 times c squared. And we have some uh, exponent here. So we're going to spread the exponent to each part. So let's try that. This here is equivalent to negative 1 to the negative one third times c squared to the negative one third. Let's see what happens here. This here is the same as negative one. And I'm going to make this uh, one over this whole thing to actually make the uh, exponent positive. So this is one third, which essentially means the cube root so this here is going to be the cube root of negative 1. And we may think that, oh, we can't take negative um, numbers in the radicand underneath the radical symbol. However, we can, because negative 1 times negative 1 times negative 1 is negative 1. This works for odd uh, indexes. However, if, of course, if this was a square root, this would not be possible. We're not working with imaginary numbers. So the cube root of negative 1 indeed is negative 1. So 1 over negative 1, this whole, this whole part here becomes negative 1 times. This part here would be exponent, bracket, exponent, we multiply. So we have c to the negative 2 thirds. And so we have this uh, negative sign here. This is equal to negative something. And the something happens to be 1 over c to the 2 thirds. We're using the reciprocal because we're changing the sign here. c to the 2 thirds. Now, what is 2 thirds? We have the numerator being the power. So this here is c squared. And the 1 third, 2 times 1 third is 2 thirds. The 1 third means we're taking the cube root. So we're taking the cube root of c squared. So we Use some basic algebra exponent rules to actually come up with this simplest form.